Biomarkers Matter, expanding options in the management of cancer. Every somatic cell has identifiable characteristics and a unique molecular signature. These biomarkers can be objectively measured in tissue, blood, or other bodily fluids to detect normal and pathogenic processes and anticipated responses to interventions. Cancer cells also exhibit identifiable characteristics. These characteristics can drive tumor growth and impact normal biological processes. Cancer biomarkers are produced either by tumor cells or by other cells in the body in response to a tumor. These tumor markers may be diagnostic, prognostic, or predictive, each offering important clues that can aid in the management of cancer. A patient's diagnostic biomarkers may signal the presence of a cancer or confirm a diagnosis. Their prognostic biomarkers can tell you about the natural course or likely outcome of their cancer. And their predictive biomarkers can help identify to which therapy they are most likely to respond. For example, knowing that a particular mutation is fueling your patient's cancer could make them a candidate for a targeted therapy, hmm? which may cause less harm to normal cells. Other biomarkers could indicate that your patient might benefit from an immunotherapy, leveraging the power of their own immune system to treat their cancer. A patient's biomarkers may also qualify them for a clinical trial studying patients who all have the same biomarker. This is especially important for your patients with rare cancers or for cancers with few treatment options. That's why biomarkers matter. So consider biomarker testing early on. If you're ordering or doing a biopsy, be sure to collect enough tissue for biomarker testing as well. Over time, if a patient develops drug resistance or suffers a relapse, that may mean their tumor cells have evolved. At that point, a second biomarker test may be needed. This could identify new or additional biomarkers that may be targets for treatment. A message from the Cholangiocarcinoma Foundation. Learn more at biomarkersmatter.org. Cholangiocarcinoma is a rare and aggressive cancer of the bile duct with few treatment options. However, broad sequencing efforts have shown that more than 50% of patients with cholangiocarcinoma have at least one targetable mutation. This could provide additional personalized treatment options, including access to clinical trials that may give these patients the chance to live longer and with a better quality of life. Actionable signatures include IDH1 mutations, FGFR fusions and mutations, HER2 amplification and mutations, BRAF mutations, NTRAC fusions, PIK3CA mutations, microsatellite instability, PDL1 expression, and high tumor mutational burden. Identification of these signatures in cholangiocarcinoma has stimulated both scientific and pharmaceutical interest in this disease. There are now several hundred trials on clinicaltrials.gov in which CCA patients are eligible to participate. Given the poor prognosis for patients treated according to standard protocol and the high frequency of actionable targets, the Cholangiocarcinoma Foundation encourages immediate profiling for all patients with cholangiocarcinoma. Repeat profiling with any subsequent biopsies may occasionally reveal a new targetable mutation that may open the door to other treatment options for these patients. Learn more at cholangiocarcinoma.org.